Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Now, ladies, we'll be speaking fashion, eh? Hmm? Let's take it up a notch. Gavin Rogers, one of those rare national treasures and humanitarian, humanitarians close to the hearts of our rainbow nation. And his latest collection, showcased for Fas Africa Fashion International, is no less than absolute genius and brilliance. Let's take a look. I think Reset, Reinvent and Reimagine is really about having taken the time to look back and reflect on what we've done, where we need to be and what it's going to take for us to get to this future world of where we can be the best versions of ourselves. I think because I've had no formal training at all in fashion, I think the idea was that I was always this outsider looking into this very intriguing world. I hadn't learned any rules, so I was kind of breaking them all the time. I think one of the first things I did was learning how to work with a mannequin or a dummy. So it was really about draping fabric, putting fabric together. Till today, my studio calls me Edward Scissorhands because I'm very good at just cutting through things. For me, my collection is really about bringing a sense of strong visibility around gender-based violence and domestic violence and women who have been victims of sexual abuse. More than anything, we've seen the transformative power of what fashion can be, and we are using that hopefully to make a difference in the country. Do I really think it's, you know, we're saving the world in fashion? No, but I think that maybe we make the world a better place. I decided to create a collection which was really based on very beautiful, simple pieces with major attention to detail. I wanted to be representative of a new tribe of women who were strong, who were uncompromising in their femininity, but at the same time were in support of one another and were strong together. So I think the concept of shooting in the rain and wanting to, to have this uh, feel was really kind of driven over the fact that, firstly, we need water. We, you know, water is a very important element for the African continent in all forms. And it's, it's almost kind of quite childlike playing in the rain. I mean, there's a famous line of song, you know, God bless the rains in Africa. And I just wanted to have that sense of rain being almost like these showers of blessing. And I think what we need now is a new sensibility of caring and loving one another.